Hello and welcome to another episode of our Top 10 channel. Today, we are embarking on a journey through the largest volcanoes in the world. Get ready to meet the most incredible and powerful mountains on Earth and discover their history and importance to our world. Shall we start? 1. Mauna Loa is one of the largest active volcanoes in the world and is located on the island of Hawaii, USA. It is also the largest volcano on the planet in terms of mass and base area. Mauna Loa is a shield mountain, meaning its surface is wide and relatively flat, the result of many consecutive eruptions that covered a large area. The first documented eruption of Mauna Loa occurred in 1843, and since then the volcano has been closely monitored by scientists to predict future eruptions. Although it has been considered relatively peaceful, Mauna Loa's eruptions can be dangerous and cause significant damage to surrounding areas. Mauna Loa is also important for science, as it has been one of the main objects of study to understand volcanic activity and the global climate. In addition, the mountain is considered sacred to the local inhabitants and is an important cultural symbol for the Hawaiian community. 2. Tiamu Massif is a submarine volcano located in the North Pacific Ocean and is considered the largest flat-topped volcano in the world. It measures approximately 145 kilometers in width and is covered by a large flat area. The maximum height is about 1 kilometer above the seafloor. Tiamu Massif is part of the Isuogasawara Archipelago chain and is one of many underwater volcanic formations found in the region. Geological studies indicate that Tiamu Massif was formed about 140 million years ago during the Cretaceous period. Volcanic activity was intense at the time, resulting in the formation of a massive chain of underwater volcanoes. However, Tiamu Massif is the only volcano in the chain that has a dome-shaped structure, making it unique compared to other underwater volcanoes. 3. Olympus Mons is the largest volcano in the solar system, located on the surface of the planet Mars. It has an altitude of approximately 22 kilometers, over three times the height of Mount Everest, the highest mountain on Earth. The base of the volcano has a diameter of about 550 kilometers, equivalent to the size of the state of Rhode Island in the United States. Olympus Mons is considered a shield volcano, meaning its structure is flat and broad, the result of many successive volcanic eruptions that deposited layers of lava and ash. The volcano is active, although there has been no recorded evidence of recent eruptions. The origin of Olympus Mons is attributed to Martian plate tectonics, which causes great pressure on the underlying magma, leading to powerful and repeated volcanic eruptions. The presence of a heat field inside Mars also contributed to the formation of this volcano. Studies of Olympus Mons have provided valuable information about Martian geology and the planet's volcanic past. Observing the volcano is also important to better understand volcanic processes on other planets and moons in the solar system. 4. Mauna Kea is an extinct volcano located on the island of Hawaii, USA. It is the highest point in the Pacific, standing 4,207 meters above sea level and approximately 10,203 meters below the water's surface. Mauna Kea is known for being one of the best locations for astronomical observation due to its high altitude and lack of artificial light and atmospheric turbulence. The volcano was formed about 1 million years ago and consists of five volcanic cones, including Puuwekiu, which is the highest point. Mauna Kea is considered extinct because there is no evidence of recent volcanic activity. However, it is still monitored to ensure the safety of the local population. The area around Mauna Kea is protected as a nature reserve and is an important center of Hawaiian culture. The climb to the summit of the volcano is popular among tourists and is a unique experience for visitors, but requires a special permit due to the high altitude and lack of oxygen. In addition, there are access restrictions to protect native species and the environment. 5. Shishaldan Volcano is an active volcano located on Unalaska Island, Aleutas, Alaska, USA. It is the most active volcano among the Aleutian Range and has an altitude of 9,372 feet, 2,857 meters. It has a conical shape and is covered in snow all year round. This volcano has a history of historical activity, with its last eruption occurring in 1999. 
It is closely monitored by local authorities and the U.S. Geological Survey due to its potential to cause damage to the local community and air traffic. Throughout history, Shishaldan volcano eruptions have been reported to produce large clouds of ash and pyroclastics, as well as lava flowing from its cone. Additionally, eruptions are accompanied by strong seismic activity and variations in sulfur dioxide released into the atmosphere. In summary, Shishaldan Volcano is one of the most important geological attractions in the Aludas, Alaska region and is closely monitored to ensure the safety of the local community. 6. The Era Caldera is one of the largest calderas in the world, located on the island of Kyushu in Japan. It is the result of a series of volcanic eruptions that took place about 22,000 years ago. With a diameter of approximately 20 kilometers, the caldera has a large crater with a freshwater lake in the center. The Sakurajima volcano, located within the caldera, is one of the most active in Japan, having recorded frequent eruptions throughout the centuries. The caldera is also surrounded by a series of volcanic mountains, including Mount Aoyama and Mount Kujira, both over 1,000 meters in height. The Era Caldera is a protected area by the Japanese government and is an important tourist destination, with spectacular views of the caldera, lake, and the volcanic mountains around it. In addition, the caldera is an important source of geothermal energy for the region, providing heat and electricity for the local population. 7. Yellowstone Caldera is a massive volcanic caldera located in the Yellowstone Geothermal Region of the United States. It is one of the largest calderas in the world, measuring about 45 kilometers in diameter and covering an area of approximately 8,000 square kilometers. It is known to be one of the most active and potentially dangerous volcanoes in the United States, with a history of catastrophic eruptions and constant seismic activity. The Yellowstone caldera is a result of a series of volcanic eruptions that took place millions of years ago. The most recent eruption occurred about 640,000 years ago and was one of the largest eruptions ever recorded on Earth. The eruption released a massive amount of ash and gases, and the resulting caldera covers a large area of the region. Today, the Yellowstone caldera is closely monitored for signs of volcanic activity. Although there are no immediate indications of an imminent eruption, the caldera continues to be an important source of geothermal energy and hot water sources, as well as a popular tourist attraction. The region is protected by Yellowstone National Park, one of the oldest national parks in the United States and one of the country's largest tourist attractions. 8. The Long Valley Caldera is one of the largest active calderas in the United States and is located in California. It is one of the best-studied calderas in the world due to its frequent seismic activity events and the presence of a large underground magma chamber. The caldera was formed about 760,000 years ago by a massive volcanic eruption that resulted in a loss of about 600 meters in surface elevation. Seismic activity in the region has been intense since the 1970s, with small earthquakes occurring frequently. Additionally, the caldera hosts several hot springs, thermal sources, and geysers, attracting tourists and visitors interested in geothermal activity. Although considered active, the Long Valley caldera does not pose immediate threats to the local population. However, it is closely monitored by scientists and volcanism specialists to ensure the safety of the area. 9. The Valles caldera is a large caldera located in southern New Mexico, USA. It is one of the largest calderas in the world, measuring approximately 20 kilometers in diameter. The caldera was formed about 1.2 million years ago by a series of volcanic eruptions that led to the collapse of the mountain top and the formation of a large crater. The caldera is known for its natural beauty, with large stretches of green meadows, dense forests, and hot thermal waters. Additionally, it is an important research area for scientists studying geology, biology, and hydrology. Today, the caldera is managed as a preserved national park and is one of the few protected land areas in the United States where scientific research is allowed and encouraged. The Valles Caldera is a popular destination for tourists and adventurers seeking to explore the beautiful landscapes and rich geological history of the region. 10. Toba Caldera is a volcanic caldera located on the island of Sumatra, Indonesia. 
It is the result of a supervolcanic eruption that took place about 74,000 years ago. This eruption is considered one of the largest ever recorded on Earth and had a significant impact on the environment and human evolution. The caldera spans about 100 kilometers and Lake Toba, one of the largest mountain lakes in the world, is located in the center of the caldera. The region is considered an important geotourism area and attracts visitors from all over the world to admire its beauty and explore its rich geological history. We hope you enjoyed this journey through the top 10 largest volcanoes in the world. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel for more interesting content. Leave your comment below and share with us what you would like to see in future videos. Thank you for watching.